Welcome to the Yes to Life show where my brother and I prepare delicious vegan fitness recipes, share cooking tips and more. And today we're gonna prepare an easy to prepare and very high protein lentil salad. So let's go. First of all, I'd recommend you to have everything set in place. So I started by prepping all of my ingredients. I have the salad ingredients right here and the dressing ingredients over there. So first of all, I take a bunch of arugula. This is sort of like two handful. I've washed it before and I add it into my salad bowl. On top of that, I'm gonna add the lentils. And in this case, I use black beluga lentils. I love them because not only are they full of protein, they also have more texture than other lentils and they have a nice color and a sort of chewier consistency. I took one cup, I soaked it, I then boiled it and now it uh, has grown in size. So it's around two cups probably right now. This salad, I'd say is for two to three people depending on how much you eat. And to add an additional source of protein and fiber, I'm gonna take white beans. Why white beans? Because the color goes really nice with the black color of the lentils, but you can also go for other type of beans, such as kidney beans or chickpeas. Then we're gonna add tomatoes. I diced two tomatoes uh, thinly, and now I'm gonna add these right here. They just add some umami flavor. I love the color, the red color goes well with the green from the arugula. And to give it some extra crunch, we're gonna take pumpkin seeds. I have two tablespoons of pumpkin seeds right here. And for some additional flavor and freshness, I'm gonna take a bit of parsley. I didn't chop that beforehand, you should. So I'm gonna do that right now. So basically just chop it roughly. For me that is fine. And I'm gonna add it into the salad. If you like, you can leave some for later if you wanna garnish your food. Now with the salad, I put it aside and it's time to prepare the dressing. For that, you take one or one and a half tablespoons of olive oil, one to one and a half tablespoons of soy sauce, that adds some more umami flavor and saltiness. Into that, for the creaminess and a nice mild note, we add um, almond butter, but you can also go for cashew butter, tahini, or any type of your favorite nut butter. Some salt to season, and for the acidity, you add in the juice of one lemon. If you squeeze it using a fork, it makes sure that the juice just flows directly into the bowl. And to adjust the consistency, you can add a bit more water, around one tablespoon, maybe two. Stir everything well until you reach your perfect consistency. You can go for more creamy or more watery, really up to you. And now all you gotta do is Pour that delicious dressing on top. Season with some black pepper. I like black pepper, so I'm adding a big pinch here. Maybe it's even two pinches. And then you just need to mix it and voila, you're ready to go. And when you serve it, you can sprinkle some fresh parsley, pumpkin seeds or sunflower seeds on top. And that's it for the video. If you like it, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel for more videos like this coming soon. Thank you for watching and see you next time.